If you would be so kind as to take a, a few moments and read us some of your poetry, I think we would really enjoy that. Thank you. It's my pleasure. And I think I'll read something old, something new, and nothing borrowed. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. This is what I tell my daughter. It's a poem that was uh, first published before it was, it was first pu published on uh, the Kotlin Review. Okay. Yeah, I think that's why, where we got this from. But it, it comes, it came out in the second book, Becoming Ebony. And now why did you write this poem? And my daughter is, uh, the, my, do my eldest daughter, her name is Bise Nyeswa, Bise Nyeswa, okay. Mm -hmm. We'll call her Bise for short. Bise, um, it's a very intelligent daughter, mm -hmm. but um, she was my first teenager in America, mm -hmm. and and she she was uh, she was a teenager, a normal American <laughs> teenager, mm -hmm. and so she actually took over my writing. Uh, I always was worried about her, mm -hmm. and I wanted to understand her. She's very complex, mm -hmm. like myself, mm -hmm. you know, and so I I felt a kinship to her. Also, because I had a kind of relationship with my mother, which my mother had with her mother, and 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 so I think she took all my my poem, uh, poems. Uh, the fourth book does not have a poem about her, mm -hmm. and she is very happy about that. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> but, <laughs> this is what I tell my daughter: <clears throat> If my father hadn't scared me, I wouldn't be here. I'd be somewhere down Jala Town or Slipway, where the Mesorado dumps its junk by dark swamps. I'd be carrying buckets full of dirt to turn Morovia swamps into dry land. Or I'd be somebody's wife trying to be somebody's wife. This is how I scare my daughter. You wouldn't be here. You'd be somewhere where babies wait in long lines to be born. Little babies with sore feet waiting in the unborn world where food can't grow. I would have had ten children before you were born. You there standing in line waiting to be born while I'd be in some overcrowded town, some unknown city or village with skinny-legged children, mucous noses, bare feet, crying for food. I'd be there one husband each month, one room each month. On Capitol Bypass, where I grew up, all the boys knew how to get a girl pregnant. All sorts of men and boys, all sorts of people lurking at windows in doorways. Plenty of men from Nigeria, from Sudan, from far away villages in Liberia, from Mars. This is what I tell my daughter. The university bringing the whole globe with horrid feet on our street emptying its men in one-room boarding houses in our backyard. My father, a barbed wire fence, his needle poking eyes, scaring boys away. The boys call him CIA chief. The girls on Capitol Bypass with their perky brown cheeks, their smooth, pretty skin, their sophisticated steps, my father called them grown up girls, bringing home sad trophies in teen arms. I have a teen daughter, so I have a need to scare her too. I love that <laughs> Okay, what else would you like to read? Okay, I will read um, The River is Rising, which is um, and the title poem of the third book, The River is Rising. Um, this time I don't have an exact title out of my book for my fourth book, 
but and this and I will always write a book and then the publishers will be fighting over titles and I say okay I read a title poem and that's how this, this poem came to be okay. but this poem is inspired was inspired by the end of the Civil War mm -hmm. and the, the, the end of the Civil War and the election and of the first female president and and you saw her on I my wanted, blog. Yeah, yeah, I wanted to ask you about yeah. her. We'll talk the about first her female president yeah. and the first and only female president in Africa and, and one of the, maybe the one or two presidents in the world. Mm -hmm. And she was elected and I was kind of emotional about the end of the war, about having a woman president and about the whole idea. And so it was a bit of a sweet experience. I was crying and I was angry. I was angry because so many people had died and just for that day to happen. So I wrote this poem, The River is Rising. The river is rising, a song for Liberian women. The river is rising and this is not a flood. After years of drought, the ground hardened and caked in blood in dry places, here we are today. River banks are swelling with the incoming tide coming in from the Atlantic just beyond the ridge of rolling hills and rocks in Morovia. Finally, here we stand at the banks. Finally, here we are. See how swiftly the tide rushes in to fill the land with salt. Fish and crabs and the huge clams and shrimps, all the river's creatures are coming in with the tide. The river is rising. But this is not a flood. Do not let your eye wander away from this scene. Yes, all the bones below the Maserato or the St. Paul or Sino or the Lofa River will be brought up to land so the overwhelming questions can once more overwhelm us. But they are bringing in our lost sister on a high stool. And there she stands waving at those who, in refusing to die, simply refuse to die. This is not a song just for Ellen. This is a song for Mapu and Tene and all the Ellens there are. This is a song for Kema and Musu and Masa. This is for Nyenemplu and Nyenemwe, for Kau and Glai and Koto, for the one solitary woman of war. This is a song so Wani will also dance. This is a song for that small girl child who came out just this morning. They are still seeking a name to call her, a river name, a name from the water and from the fire too. That solitary mother in flight will no longer birth her child at the roadside where shells where her baby's first bed. Let the womb quiver, let church bells jingle, let hundreds of drums pound, clang, clang, tay. Let men bring out old trumpets so the wind will take flight. Let that small pepper bird on a tree branch sing and cry no more the solitary song. Let the mess rattle behind my home, or what was my home, or still is, or maybe, maybe who cares? The river is rising, but this is not a flood. Mm -hmm.